Hello and welcome back to my channel. So I've got a pretty little thing haul for you today. Just some bits and pieces I've been picking up over the past month or so. Um, they've still got all of these products because I checked this morning. Um, a lot of like comfy sort of like joggers, sweatshirts sort of thing. Um, since, you know, I'm not going anywhere. Um, I just thought, why not share it? Definitely shouldn't be buying clothes since I'm probably not going to be going anywhere. Summer, probably, maybe autumn at this rate. <laughs> but, you know, I'll look cute around the house, so at least that's something, I guess. But yeah, so I thought, why don't I start off with, oh, well this top isn't from Pretty Little Thing, but I thought I'd mention it. I don't know why I look so like spring summery like the sun's out today like it is about minus four and there's still snow on the roofs but it's just making me think of being out in the sun enjoying myself so yeah this is a collusion top you can see there it's absolutely massive like this is a size 10 it was like 12 pounds um and it's in like a pe like pe sort of material you know like when you used to wear those like pe polo tops but it's really nice, like it's huge, it covers my bum. So if you don't like your tops that big, then you could definitely size down. I've got goosebumps, it's that gold. Um, but yeah, I just thought it was like really cute and plain, like wear it about the house. You could just like wear it on a walk with some leggings or something, since like I know everyone's on walks these days. Um, when it starts to warm up a bit, like chuck on some shorts instead and some trainers and things that just look really cute. I love a big t-shirt when it's like nice and warm. I love a big t-shirt all year round really, but you know, some days you just don't want to wear really tight clothing. You want something nice and loose and comfortable. So yeah, got this one first. I thought I'd get that out of the way. Okay, so the first thing, I'm like literally nearly lost this. I didn't even know where it had gone to. Um, is this cardigan. I should probably button it up or you're not going to be able to see what it even looks like. Right, I put all the prices on my phone, so I've shown this cardigan before in two different colours, actually a little gloss on my hand, um, in a past Pretty Little Thing haul and now I've got it in a third apparently. So this was £15, I got a size medium, definitely could have got a small, I just picked up the same size I got in the other ones. It's this chocolate brown, it's actually like a dark chocolate brown um, cardigan. Like, it's just long sleeves. Um, it's not particularly cropped. Like, you could tuck this into some jeans. You could wear this with some, like, leather trousers. I bought this around Christmas time because I just thought it would be cute. I don't even know if I actually ended up wearing it. Maybe I did. I'm not sure. But, yeah. I thought it would be more chocolate. It's definitely more dark chocolate, but I still really like it. Um... Yeah, it's just super easy to chuck on. You could wear this in so many different ways. Like I said, I've got two other colours of it. And this, this comes in like every colour under the sun. Um, because it's just so comfortable and will go with basically anything. So I got that one. I thought I'd mention this coat. I didn't actually buy this. I got given this as a Christmas present, but I just thought it was really cute. And I should show you. So, what size? This is in a size 10. I've kind of got a size 8, but it's nice to be able to have like a big comfy puffer coat, be able to fit jumpers and stuff under it. So it's this sage green, sage green uh, puffer jacket. It's in the like peach skin. Um, it's got the cuff sleeves, which are amazing. So when you go out, it means like no wind goes like whipped up in your arms, it makes you cold or anything. So just like the same colour zip and uh, a funnel neck. This is amazing. This is like one of the only coats I've been wearing, like one of two, when I leave the house. Um, it has pockets as well. Um, yeah, I absolutely love this coat. I love the colour. I love how comfy it is. It's like wearing a little duvet on the top half of your body. Um, it sort of comes to like around the bum area so it's not super long um yeah if you wanted it more cropped you could probably size down because it's kind of oversized but yeah i just thought it was really cute in that 
I should share it. I thought this would actually look really nice in like the spring as well because of the colour of it. So yeah, I've got like a pile of clothes here. Um, I picked up a pair of che jeans. Jeans. Probably before Christmas. They do still have them because, you know, there was me thinking maybe a bit too optimistically that we might be able to go out and about and do some things again. I was wrong, <laughs> but that's fine. Um, I think it's all these on Sarah Ashcroft. Like Sarah Ashcroft's everything goals, but she always picks up a good pair of jeans. Um, so it's these, they're my little code hanger. Light wash, straight leg jeans basically. Now, oh my God, you can literally see the marks I've made from where I was cutting them because these were like, you know, like a normal hem whatever that means, um, but these were super long, like these were in the regular section, but these should have been in the tall section, these were super long, like I never buy petite trousers, never have to cut my trousers, I had to cut these, these were about four inches too long, um, but that's fine, don't mind doing that to jeans, like it's not that hard, um, they just look really nice, they kind of like remind me of Levi's, these were... 28 pounds. I mean, there's always discounts on pretty little things, so they probably were a lot less than that. Um, and I got these in an eight, I think. Eight or a ten? No, I got these in a ten. Um, yeah, pretty little things. Denim comes up like quite small, I find. Um, so yeah, if you like between sizes, I'd pick the bigger size. But yeah, I just thought these like they kind of got like that baggy vibe that looks really cool with like boots or trainers. Um, and hopefully I'll get to wear these at some point. Um, but yeah, until like until then, that's fine. They can stay in the wardrobe. Like, did you, like light wash jeans aren't going out of fashion, so that's fine. I'm not upset about it. But I also bought this top that I thought would look cute with it. Got hair or something. Like. As you can see by the label, still I haven't had jeans. <laughs> This is a mucka stretch slinky high neck crop top in a 10. I think I saw Molly May wear something like this and it looked really cute. So this is like a like a light chocolate brown. Um, yeah, like a slinky material, feels really nice. Crop top, you could definitely wear a bra with this because of the shape of the neckline and stuff. Um, or not if you wanted to because it's not see-through. This was, how much were you? £12 in a tan. Yeah, like I thought th this with some jeans and some heels, like for a dinner or something, or like leather leggings, leather trousers. You could even wear this with joggers, like it's just a super simple top, and like you could just pair this with whatever you wanted. And I don't have any like little brown crop tops, so I thought I'll grab that one. Now the rest of the stuff is all comfy stuff, I think we'll all be pleased to know. Um, so the first thing I got, it's a little piece of fluff on, is this ugh, massive sweatshirt. There's a picture of me uh, in this on my Instagram, I got this in a large, I like my jumpers to be nice and big. I always find that they get a little bit smaller if you put them in the washer or in the dryer or whatever and I like them to be Nice and big to pair with like leggings, joggers, around the house, whatever. But this one's really cute. It says weekend, weekend chills. Yeah. And it has this little star and a moon on it. Um, and I just thought it was really cute. It's got like the fluffy bit on the inside. And I think there's another colour of this, like maybe cream or white or something I just thought like you know perfect loungewear I don't have many sweatshirts or like hoodies or anything so this was just like one of the ones I picked up and it's in this like sort of medium like medium grey mall sort of wash because I have this like proper like ash grey jumper here so this isn't like their like regular like reoccurring sweatshirt selection sort of thing so oh hold on that weekend jumper was £18 this jumper is £15 so this comes in like a bunch of different colours they have like 
these oversized sweatshirts, their hoodies and their casual joggers that are like they always have and they just bring out different colours of them all the time. So I got this again probably before Christmas. Um, like I said, it didn't have any sweatshirts. It's freezing so I wanted a few more and um, got this in a large again um, and then basically my boyfriend stole it the whole time so I bought him one of his own at Christmas but yeah so I've managed to get mine back I really love the colour of this I have the this is ash grey there's like a couple of greys they do I have the casual joggers in this and they like it like matches so that's great um, that wasn't intentional but I'm chuffed about that um, I think I'm probably going to pick up a few more colours of this. Actually, tell a lie. There's two more colours of this in this haul, so maybe I don't need to make up any more colours. But yeah, super comfy. Like, I just want to live in this 24-7 right now because, like, it's cold. I want to be warm and, like, cosy. And everyone needs this. Like, boys, girls, it's essential. And then I picked up this dark grey dark grey, dark green, like forest green set. Now they are ever so slightly different shades. It's not as noticeable in person as it's looking on this camera right now and I'm kind of bummed about it to be honest but it's fine. I saw Black Dope on Instagram wear it, I think her name's Kim, and I was like yes please, that colour's delicious. I love a bit of green. This forest green is amazing. So this jumper is the exact same as the ash grey one but in forest green in a large, uh, I assume the same price. Yeah, so comfy. Got the soft bit on the inside. Like the colour's just so cute. And then these joggers are, I think they're the casual joggers. Um, I got these in a small. Now these, oh, the casual joggers just do things to me like I honestly have so many pairs of pretty little thing joggers it's offensive like I don't have anywhere to put them so I don't know why I keep buying them but it's all I wear I wear joggers 24 7 they have the cuff bottom the cuff top with the um the tie on the inside the fluffy bit on the inside they're just so like soft and squishy and comfortable and I also got this set in navy because again, I saw Black Tape wear it on Instagram and I was like, okay, well I need that now. I don't have any like green like joggers or hoodie sweatshirts at all. I keep saying grey or did I say green? Green. Green. Um, until now. And like I've definitely mentioned in videos, it's my favourite colour to wear. Like if you have brown features, green's just like super complimentary of that. And then, so I bought the navy as well. I mean, it's the exact same, so I haven't brought it up to show you because you don't need to see the same jumper three times. <laughs> but yeah, it's just the navy uh, jumper in large. And then the joggers are basically the same as this, but they just have pretty little thing embroidered on them in white, but I'll link them below. I always get the bottoms in a small and the jumper in a large. Um, and that's what I'd recommend you doing. I'm like an eight to 10. Um, for reference and the joggers and you can tighten them or loosen them anyway so yeah these are just like a few random bits I bought definitely just going to be living in the sweatshirts and joggers to be honest with you but yeah I'm just like obsessed with this green colour so much I might have to ha keep an eye out to see if they bring out any more colours I really want um like a cobalt blue set as well I would love if they brought one of those out but yeah, um, I'm waffling now. Anyway, so that's just my little pretty little thing haul. Um, if you liked anything, let me know if you pick it up. And I'll leave all the links to everything down below. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.